Hello and welcome back. My name is Garrett Gann. I'm an Orange County realtor and host of YouTube's Living in OC. If you are looking to move to the vibrant city of Costa Mesa, you need to watch this video in its entirety. Today I am spilling the tea on the top four cons to living in Costa Mesa that you will absolutely need to be able to handle before you call this place home. Let's get directly into it starting with con number one. The high cost of living. Now, one of the biggest cons of living in Costa Mesa is going to be the high cost of living. Despite a median income that is about 20% higher than the national average, the cost of living in Costa Mesa does run about 75% higher than what you would expect to pay um, throughout the rest of the country. Definitely a significant margin to consider and it can be a drawback for some people for sure. However, the cost of homes in Costa Mesa honestly is not that terrible when compared to other semi-coastal cities in Orange County and Los Angeles. If you are interested in a complete deep dive in the cost of living in Costa Mesa, definitely go check out the video I did on the cost of living in Costa Mesa. I'll provide a link to that video in the description below. In that video, I break down everything from housing to utilities, goods and services, everything that you'll need to know. Moving on to con number two, we have the high property crime rate. Now, another con to consider is the higher than average property crime rate in Costa Mesa. While violent crimes do occur at a much lower rate than the national and state average, you are more likely to have property either stolen or destroyed in Costa Mesa compared to other neighboring cities like Newport Beach or Irvine, for example. Now, with that said, Irvine is considered the safest city in America for its size, and Newport Beach, it's not far behind that, so we are comparing to extremely high standards in this area. Globally speaking, though, Costa Mesa is substantially safer than other similarly dense urban or suburban areas. Now, let's move on to the next con on our list but quickly if you are new to the channel i want to welcome you like i said my name is garrett i am a realtor but beyond that i am a resource for those of you out there who are looking to make those critical decisions here in the costa mesa or the orange county marketplace if that is you or if you have any questions regarding buying selling or relocating to orange county pause this video now and write down the number on your screen. This is my personal line and reach out to me directly by calling or texting at any time. Now back to the video and on to the next con of living in Costa Mesa. We have the population density. Costa Mesa sits right in the heart of Orange County and its location as a conduit to the beach for pretty much all of central Orange County means that residents here do experience high population density. Tourists can be a big part of life here, particularly during those summer months when the Orange County Fair is in full swing and tourism is at its peak. While this can be exciting for some people, it can feel a bit crowded at times and that's certainly not for everybody. So again, just another con to be aware of and consider before making the move here. Now on to the last con of living here in Costa Mesa, we have the traffic. Now this does go hand in hand with our last con, but like many of the cities here in Southern California, Costa Mesa does experience a high volume of traffic, especially during those warmer months. Like I mentioned, beach traffic does pass through Costa Mesa for access to Newport Beach and Huntington Beach. And you can certainly feel that driving the freeways here and even on the surface streets. However, this is just part of life here in Southern California, and it's not necessarily unique to just Costa Mesa. It's just one of those things that have to be accepted when choosing to live in such a desirable location. Despite these cons, Costa Mesa has a ton to offer its residents, and I certainly do not want to downplay that here. It is an absolutely thriving community with a ton of amenities, but nowhere is going to be perfect, and it is important to weigh those downsides to living in Costa Mesa before you make that decision to call this place home. It, of course, all just comes down to you and your specific needs. With that said, if you do have any questions regarding Costa Mesa or what it's like to live here in Orange County, do not hesitate to reach out to me directly. I love to hear from you guys. I help people buy, sell, and relocate to this area for a living and I absolutely love what I do. Other than that, if you did find any value in this video, please hit that thumbs up button for me. It does help me out tremendously and consider subscribing as I am dropping multiple videos a week for all things living in Orange County, California. Thank you so much for tuning in and I'll see you in the next video.